Welcome to Watch Mojo UK, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 naughtiest Holly Willoughby moments. Where was Alan in Alan? It already came out, they always come out. Other than the mouse? Yes. Oh. Yeah. Well, we'll be grateful for that. For, that. <laughs> the other, uh, for this list, we'll be looking at the cheekiest TV appearances of this morning star, Holly Willoughby, whether they were intentional or not. What's your favourite Holly moments? Let us know in the comments below. Do you want to come and do it with me? I've got the. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> Number 10, she likes a... This Morning. Early on in lockdown, This Morning asked viewers to send pictures of their pets to the show. Holly, as always, was almost weeping at how adorable the little things were, but then they came across a breed with a peculiar name. He says this is five-month-old Milo. <laughs> he's a he's a cockachon. Of course, Holly had to step in it right away. What's a cockachon? Cocker spaniel and a bichon frise. I like a cockachon. Do you? <laughs> Her embarrassment is instantaneous and the two burst out laughing. However, this is made significantly worse by the fact that Russell Crowe had been listening the whole time. There's Russell! Oh, there's Russell! There he is! <laughs> Number 9. A Little Tipsy. The One Show. Holly. Hello, Holly! How are you? It's so nice to be here. After Phil had just called in sick earlier that morning, Holly had to double down on her usual role. However, it just so happened it was the same day she had to appear on The One Show. Fans watching noticed that Holly sounded a little out of it. Perhaps because she was a little tipsy. Got that? Aww. Yeah, lovely. Safe. Nice. Safe. It had already been a very long day for Holly, so we can hardly blame her if that was the case. No way! That's my car! Her cheeriness really brought the mood of the show up. So, whether she was just a little tired or a little drunk, we're just glad it happened. It's a night of unexpected moments. Number eight, making sausages. This morning. I like you made the a film there. Yeah. Yeah, I did. Yeah. Why is that? I don't know, I'm just fond of a chipolata. Okay. It's just it's, nicer. It's, let's not even go there. Making sausages on this morning. What could possibly go wrong? Well, of course, it isn't long before the giggling started. While Phil Vickery tried to power on through the segment and teach the nation how they could do the same, Holly was making that particularly difficult. You just can't do that, that laughing, really, can you? It's it's done, just, it does look it's funny. It's just rude. It's like being at school, isn't it? <laughs> she actually got hands on with the machine herself. <laughs> yeah, like okay, turn okay. it on, turn it on. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> to close the segment off, Phil makes a very naughty implication. Students up and down the country right, won't well, sleep tonight, I I'll tell take... you. Number seven, Holly's history. Play the whistle. <laughs> Sometimes the past has a funny way of popping up. When Holly hosted this comedy panel show, she was joined by none other than Jake Humphrey. Jake and I have actually known each other for a very, very long time. Very long time. No. The two had a light-hearted reminisce about their time spent together when they were younger, though things took a turn for the awkward when Jake dropped a little bit of a bombshell. We just come yeah. up and, and stay with you. Shared a bed. You come up and what? <laughs> While we're sure this was totally innocent, it did seem like quite an odd thing to bring up on national television. We didn't share a bed, I slept on your floor. For a bit, then you couldn't be bothered <laughs> to get the mattress out if you remember. Number six, when Holly met Colin, this morning. Don't look just yet. Holly, could you hold this up against yourself? Yes. Perfect. Philip, I don't know if I've got the full thing. Through uh, what you were giving off here, I've got some of the details. And we don't know how she managed to make this one naughty. Real life Sherlock Holmes, Colin Cloud, came onto the show to display his amazing talents. By just observing Phil, he was able to deduce something incredible that only he would know. That is so freaky. Oh my. Can I show everyone? Absolutely, let them see. Daughter moving in, stubbed toe. Both our hosts and the viewers were amazed by this display, so much so that Holly said this. Oh, please do me. I know we haven't got time to do it now, but can you just stay and do me? Honestly, girl, we know he's impressive, but there's no need to be so blunt. Number five, naughty vegetables. This morning, vegetables. How bad could it be? Katie says we found a bum shroom once. I mean, that is the Kardashian of the fun guy family, isn't it? <laughs> well, for the This Morning crew, this was one salacious salad of a segment. The item starts off innocent enough, but every so often, a rude-looking piece of veg pops up in their feed. Lindsay says this 
Butternut Squash made me giggle. It soon descends into chaos when a particularly hairy carrot shows up on the feed and Holly lets out this belter. This one says, that's my carrot situation right now. What could I say? Oh, that one needs a wax. But the one that really got her going is this bizarre parsnip. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. How this all appeared on daytime TV, we'll never know. Number four, playing House of Tongue. Celebrity Juice. Let's just say it's this show is absolutely filthy and we're genuinely surprised Holly is part of it. By her side throughout it all is her bestie, Finn Cotton, and the two have done some rather peculiar challenges along the way. Very much in the way here. Take for instance the House of Tongue, where Holly and Finn had to pick up an olive together using their tongues. Oh, If you've only ever seen Holly on daytime TV, this will probably be a shock to your system. Yeah! Number three, Giant Pumpkin, This Morning. Holly often says she doesn't realize she's said something naughty until Phil points it out. This segment absolutely proves it. As the two were interviewing farmers who had produced a pumpkin of whopping proportions, Holly pulled this out. Is there a site called bigmarrow.com? Because I don't know whether you can see this, but David, who is head of wardrobe here at This Morning, created this monster. I mean, it's not quite as impressive as yours. Now, she doesn't seem to catch on herself, but what she's saying is a bit of an eyebrow razor. And it's quite on the large side. So in order to progress this to your sort of size, it's just water and love, really. Phil just couldn't let her get away with it and poked some fun at her when the segment came to a close. I think right. we should say, really be very careful before you Google bigmarrow.com. <laughs> <laughs> Number two, Muscles. This morning, probably Holly's most iconic accidental innuendo. Her hilarious reaction to a smooth cup of coffee in 2013 almost made it onto today's list. You know when you don't know whether it's actually gone in because it's so smooth? But nothing tops her tasting muscles with Gino De Campo. The thing is, she doesn't like them, but Phil insists that she eats one anyway. I'm not eating a big one. I'll eat a little, oh, that's a big one. I can't, I can't. Mustering enough courage to pop it in her mouth, it's left for Gino to try and style this one out. Once it's in, I love it. But nice, is he? <laughs> hey! Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. Number 1. The Banana Challenge – Celebrity Juice How could it possibly get any naughtier than that olive challenge, you ask? Well, leave it to Celebrity Juice to come up with this madness. It sounds easy, it sounds simple, but it's not that simple because our teams will be connected via a banana in the mouth. Once again joined by Fern, Holly's goal for this task is to carry a banana with their mouths through an obstacle course. Keith Lemon truly is the mad scientist of rude games. Through down the ramp, through the hole, through the hole. Of course, the girls do an excellent job. It's technically not X-rated, but for our money, it's certainly Holly's naughtiest moment. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo UK and subscribe for more great content.